What's up, YouTube? Welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, Shalee Janae, and I'm back with another video. Y'all, Happy New Year. I don't know if I'm posting this video on a Wednesday or a Sunday, but whenever y'all see it, y'all gonna see it. But this year, I'm, like, super excited. I have so many goals, so many things, like, planned for myself, for my channel, everything. So y'all make sure y'all stay tuned, subscribe to my channel, like, comment, follow me on social media, which is always in my description box. And yeah, this is going to be a really good year for all of us. I'm speaking positivity and prosperity on everybody and hope everybody has a good new year. But anyway, let's get into this video. So yeah, I did this myself. Like I really did this by myself, but I list all the hair details in the description box. This isn't a sponsored video. I literally bought this wig with my own coins because I had plans with this hair to do like pictures and stuff, but now I have a different idea <laughs> for what I want to do. So I just decided to do like the skunk stripe, which is trending right now. It's a four by four. Oh, let me show y'all. Let me show y'all the details. But um, this, this is an Amazon wig actually. It's 22 inches. And it's a four by four. Ooh. Oh, this is a little messed up. It's a four by four closure though. And oh, I feel like this is the best install I've ever done. Like from start to finish. 22 inches. Or is it 20? It's 22 inches. But oh, I guess I must. But yeah, it's 22 inches and it's a 4x4 four four closure. I got some strings. But anyway, if y'all want to see how I got my hair like this, then keep watching. Oh yeah, and this was actually supposed to be um, neon pink, but I guess it's like right now. So anyway. If y'all want to see how I got my hair like this, then just keep watching and make sure y'all subscribe to my channel. Alright, I'll catch you guys in my next video. Bye. Alright, what's up y'all? So, basically, alright, I'm using 40 Developer and the regular bleach powder whatever and i mean y'all know how to dye hair like there's a million videos on how to bleach some hair but anyways so just to talk to y'all real quick happy new year make sure y'all subscribe to my channel like comment share this video all that do all that good stuff and i'm super excited to post this video because i posted a little snippet of this on my instagram story and everybody was going crazy so yeah, I'm really, I'm, I usually don't do color because I'm always like mad nervous about color. I like, literally, I just keep it simple. I'll do like black or just wear the wig or the hair color in its natural state. I feel like the, what's the, let me see. I think I did, no, I don't think I even really do color. The most color that I've ever had in my life is when I dyed my hair, the ginger color. But anyway, I put the 40 developer volume mix whatever bleach on there and i'm not even gonna lie y'all i don't even know how long i let it sit on there maybe like 15 to 20 minutes and honestly i should have left it on there longer because y'all see in a few that it came out like kind of like brown i should have let it sit longer because originally i was going for like pink which is really bold of me to be doing but i was trying to get pink and y'all see in the next clip that after everything was said and done ended up being red so it is what it is it still look cute so yeah so here i am putting the neon pink that was actually red on the wig and just keep watching at this point Okay, 
Okay, so here I am the very next day. I had my ball cap on from the previous day, y'all. I'm, I'm literally on a roll. <laughs> like, I did an install on the Friday, and then I did this install the very next day. So, I had one wig on for, like, less than an hour, no lie. And then I had went ahead and took it off. Because I really don't, I don't know, I should be going through these phases where I don't really want to wear wigs. But anyway, so the color that I'm putting on my wig this time is the Maybelline New York Fit Me in the color all oh, foundation in the color classic tan i think this is i don't know, know y'all from when i used to get my hair done and stuff i used to um just ask them what color to be putting on my ball cap or on my wig so i could know for next time and crap i was supposed to tell y'all what um freaking spray i was using on my lace I think it's called like even something i can't remember but i'll link it down in the description box below but that hold is very very good like i'll never use got to be again for putting on my wig like i don't do glue because i don't wear my wigs long enough like literally i have both of my wigs on just for the video and then i just take it off because i don't know like i said i'm going through a phase where i don't really feel like wearing weaves like i just want to wear my real hair um so yeah but I'll list all the products that I used in my description box and stop using got to be spray because that shit is trash. We gotta, you know, it's a new year. We gotta step up our products that we're using for our hair. And got to be spray is one of the things that has to go. But I did use that for spraying on my ball cap, but that's it. I wouldn't use it for my wig again. But I'm just rambling at this point. Y'all can just finish watching me lay my wig and if y'all have any tips on getting your wig super 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 flat comment that down below because i feel like no matter how much wax stick i use no matter how many times i go over it with a hot comb it just don't be flat enough like i don't know maybe i'm just using the wrong wax stick because i just picked up anything to be honest so also comment down below which wax stick y'all be using so mine can get as flat as the stylist because i'm trying to have my hair laid this year for when I really do be putting on my wigs. But this was literally one of the best installs that I've ever done in my life from start to finish. So I'm really proud of myself. And this year I plan on doing like more color because I'm always scared of color. But I'm going to try new things and see what I like. But yeah, anyway, I'm just rambling at this point. Make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll catch you guys in my next video. Bye.
Thank you.